Hey, welcome back to my YouTube channel, everyone. I am here at Jenny's Ice Cream. I am in the Lakeview area in downtown Birmingham, and I got invited out to try their new fall lineup of ice cream. So I am gonna be trying them out. Today I got brown butter almond brittle, dark chocolates, mint chocolate chip, banana cream pudding dairy free, pumpkin cake roll, salty caramel, Boston cream pie, cream puff, cookies and cream, and wild lavender. So I am going to try these out today for y'all. So the first flavor is brown butter cookie almond, which is actually the flavor I came to try because that is my favorite flavor. Oh yeah, mm, it is giving everything that I thought it would. Next, I'm going to try up the darkest chocolate. It's a rich chocolate. Mm. Oh, that is so good, oh my God. Oh, okay. Excuse the sounds, guys. We are in the middle of downtown, this cute little swanky place, this cute little district, and I am out here trying things out. This is the mint chocolate chip, mint chip, actually. Mm. Tastes like a mint Girl Scout cookie and ice cream. Delicious. Okay, banana cream pudding, dairy-free. banana-y for me. Tastes like a sugar-free cookie, kind of. It's okay. Not my favorite, but I think people who don't like a lot of sugar, this will be perfect for them, and it's dairy-free. Um, and then next up, I got pumpkin cake roll. Let's see how that is. Mmm. tastes just like a pumpkin cake roll. It's good. If you like pumpkin flavors, you will love this one. Next up, I got salty caramel. Mm. It is good. It tastes like a deep caramel flavor, like a caramel latte, I would say. Mm. It's good. I can eat that. Next up, we got Boston cream pie. Mm. I'm not too familiar with Boston cream pie but I will tell you that this is very tasty. It's got like some pie pieces in here. It's got chocolate and that creamy flavor. I can eat that. Next up, we got cream puff. Mm. Mm. A zesty or some type of flavor hits you and um, candy-like vanilla custard is what it's, it says. And it has uh, Bavarian sour cream and pastry flakes like a puff pastry. So I can certainly taste that. All right, next up, I know my son is getting tired. Thank you, Sonny, for over there rocking the camera for mom. Next up, we got cookies and cream. Mm. Tastes like Oreo cookies and cream to me. Mm. So, not Oreo, but a chocolate truffle-like cookie 
that's very similar. I can certainly tell that it's not Oreo cookies, but it tastes very similar. All right, last but not least, this is the one that Sonny tried and he liked. It was wild, wild berry lavender. So let me see how that one is. Mm. Oh, I didn't think that I would like this one. I do love lavender, but I don't typically eat it. I just like to smell it, but um, it's very aromatic and it certainly um, tastes how lavender would smell, if that makes sense, but that's what I'm tasting here. Now, I love Jenny's ice cream. I buy it in my local Publix, but to find out that they had one in my city was absolutely awesome. I don't get over here much, but it's a great place. Um, but I will say that out of all of these, my favorite, I do believe, was the brown butter almond brittle, which is what exactly what I would I thought it would be. Any type of butter ice cream, like uh, butter pecan, I love. So this is more like butter and almonds together, and it's brown butter, so it makes it even better. Um, so I'm gonna take a last bite of that. We're gonna look around a little bit. We're gonna get a picture of the ice cream shop and we are going to end this video if you're new here guys please go ahead and like if you uh enjoyed this review please consider subscribing if you are not subscribed and um definitely leave me some comments down below to let me know which of these would have been your favorite flavor had you tried them out um but like i said the brown butter almond brittle is a fave um, and on that note, guys, I am out. Thank y'all so much for watching today and um, hope to see you next time. Bye.